Hey everybody, it's Angie and welcome to Hot and Flashy. Hey, I was wondering if you guys could do me a huge favor and help me pick the frames for my new eyeglasses. Now, I've been on the hunt for glasses. I went to Costco and I got these little glasses that I consider my Mrs. Claus glasses. I don't love them and so I really don't wear them. And in the meantime, I have gotten contact lenses. So while I love my contacts, there are days when my eyes feel really dry and really tired from wearing the contacts. And so I would just like to give my eyes a break and have groovy glasses that I can feel good about wearing and not feel like I look like Mrs. Claus in my little Mrs. Claus glasses. So at exactly the same time that I was starting to try on glasses at glasses shops all over the place, I was contacted by a company called David Kind Eyewear. And they asked me if I'd be interested in uh, trying on their glasses. So of course, you know, I said, sure, I'm right in the market for glasses. The timing on this couldn't be any better it's perfect. So um, I signed up for the service and the way it works is that they have an online shop and you go there and you browse the styles. Then if you think you're ready to go ahead and um, try some on, you fill out their form and it asks you all kinds of questions about what your personal likes and dislikes are about in glasses, how you usually fit other glasses, and um, then you upload a couple of photos to them and then the great part about this is the personalized service that you get. They assign you a personal optician who builds a fit and style profile for you. Then you look through all their frames and you pick three pairs to try and the stylist picks three pairs for you. Then they mail the six sets of frames with just clear glass in them out to you. You have six days to try them on at your leisure at home. And it's great because I've been wearing mine all day, each one. So for the six days, I'm going to wear one all day just to make sure it's comfortable and really fit my face. I walk around in them because they're clear glass. I can wear my contacts. Um, and I see if people compliment me on them or if they're like, you know, and just getting opinions. So it's a great way to try on the glasses and you work with the personal optician until you find the right pair for you. So even if in the first set of six, you don't like anything, or you saw something online that you were hoping they picked, but they didn't, um, you can keep working with them until you find the perfect pair. And they have a decent range of styles. I gotta say, I've been to some of the really high end shops and some of the really low end shops and I've tried on hundreds of styles and could not find anything that I liked even closely as much as I like a few of the things in this little box right here. They send a beautiful package. This is a beautiful cork box with embossing here and I get to keep this for six days and then I return the samples. And after that, once I pick something, then my glasses will arrive in five to 10 business days. So let me just show you what came inside. So you open it up. Oh my goodness, look at that big beautiful mirror. Oh, you can see the mess on my desk. I'll hold this open with my face. A personal note from my personal optician. Inside the box are six beautiful frames. So the styles I picked are on the side closest to me and the styles that the personal optician picked are on this side farther from me. Let's start trying on frames and you guys can help me. So I'm gonna tell you the name of each frame and then um, you guys can vote. You can leave your comments below where you vote for the frames. I don't know if I'm gonna pick the one that you gets the most votes. I'm gonna maintain some veto power here, um, but I think that we'll probably agree because what the heck, you guys know what looks good on me and sometimes I don't. <laughs> so let's go ahead with the first set of frames. This is the Roman in Dusk. And this is one of my favorites. It's a little big for my face on the side, as you can see, but I kind of like that about it. I kind of like that it's like big and in your face and kind of over the top nerdy. Um, I really dig that. And what I like the best about it is that it doesn't have the continuous plastic across the bridge of the nose. Where the glasses sit, they make an indent in my skin and it takes a lot longer for your skin to puff back out once it's been dented. Anyway, that's what I like about these. All right, next pair. This one is the Trenton in Glacier Gray. I picked a lot of like soft grays and clears. Uh, I really like the color choices that they offered. It wasn't everything in tortoise or black and that was all you had to pick from. These I feel are just a little bit too low on my eye. I can actually see the top of the frame as I'm looking through it. And so I think these are just a little too small for my field of vision, but I do like them. They're cute, but again, the nose problem here. 
All right, the next one is Raleigh in Citrine Quartz. And I really love this color plastic. I just like wish that these were slightly different. I wish they had a little cutout here, that they were higher here. These have the same problems as the last pair, which is that they're just a little bit too low in my field of vision. All right, so these are the three that the personal optician picked. This one is the Clover in Granite. I think this is her favorite. And this for me is the second runner up or possibly my favorite. I like these because they're so lightweight and the plastic just feels so well made on all of these. But these ones are really the most lightweight and the ones where I really love the color. I really dig these and I think they almost match the line of my eyebrows. I just wish that the um, Roman wasn't just a little bit too wide for me. These I think fit my face more uh, perfectly over here. They do have the cutout up here, so that's good. They won't give me the dent at the top of my nose. And they do still have that big, nerdy look, but not quite as big as the Roman. The next one is the Laurel in Moreto Tortoise. And this one's just okay. I think it's a little dark and a little heavy for me. Um, I do like that it does go up closer to my natural brow line. These are kind of cute. I think I'm going to get a better idea looking at myself on video than taking pictures of how they look. And I think when I play it back, I'll get a much better idea. This one is the Atlas in Leaf. And each of these frames comes in three or four different colors. I pick the color that I like it best in. And where she picked this one, I. Um, had said I didn't really want any colors per se, but she sent me this green one because she thought that it would um, go well with on me. So I think this one's cute. My oldest daughter likes this one the best. These are the traditional cat eye, although with a modern twist that they're in a colored plastic. I think these are actually really pretty and flattering, and I, I do kind of like these too. So those are the frames. Of course, you guys can vote, and please vote by style name. And each one comes with this cute little uh, remarks card where you can mark down how the fit is, too just right, too loose, too tight, your comments, buy, save for later, or no thanks. So the personal optician sends you a little card that tells you, you know, why they picked, what they picked for you. And then if you're ready to purchase, there's a how to purchase card with instructions. It seems pretty easy and straightforward. You basically tell them which frame you want. You put it on your face and you take a picture of yourself with your cell phone, then you upload that to the site and that helps them measure where to put your prescription. And unlike a lot of the other uh, eyeglass companies, these come in progressives, which is what I was so excited about because I wear progressives. They send you the return shipping label so that you send the whole thing back, it's on them, and then they send you your glasses. Now the glasses are $2.95 a pair and that includes the frames and a Trivex high index HD lens, which is the clearest, thinnest, widest prescription range. And I'm so hoping that these lenses are way better than my Costco lenses because those things, it's so narrow where the actual prescription is and the rest is just glass and I can't, I have no peripheral vision. They're so hard to see out of. So I'm hoping that these are gonna be just awesome lenses. Um, they're supposed to be so much better than conventional polycarbonate lenses, lighter, clearer, crisper vision, which is what I really want because I am such a stickler and a perfectionist. And I, that's another reason I really haven't worn my glasses besides that they don't look great, is that the lenses are you know thick and heavy and the vision isn't terrific out of them. So I have really high hopes for these. And of course, you'll probably be seeing me wearing them and I'll let you know how the lenses are in a follow-up video after I get the glasses with the lenses. The lenses also include 
uh, two coatings, anti-reflective and anti-scratch, so I can't wait for that anti-reflective so that I can actually film in them, which would be great. So $2.95 is for regular prescription lenses. There's an $80 upcharge for progressives, which is what I am, and they're freeform progressives, so there's no lines. And there's $50 for 1.74 material. I don't even know what that is. And there's another $50 for transition lenses, so if you want them to turn into sunglasses when you go outside. I think for $2.95 or if you add another 80, it's a great price price because I paid uh, 250 for the glasses that I got at Costco and I never wear and I hate the lenses. So for not too, too much more, these glasses I'm hoping are gonna be just perfect. So put your votes in the comments below and I can't wait to see what you guys think about the glasses, but thanks everybody in advance for helping me pick. It's such a tough decision, gosh, um, but I really appreciate your help. And as always, thanks for watching and I will see you next time, maybe with my new glasses. See you later everybody, bye-bye.